This stage has been set since March 2020. When the pandemic hit, Laura Secord Secondary School was just a few days away from opening night of their production of Mamma Mia. Two years later, with a new cast and a new crew, the show goes on. Mama Mia, here I go again. So we had to start from scratch. We do have, I think, eight students who are in it. They were in grade nine or 10 two years ago, and so uh, they're still in it. And we do have some cast that were in the crew two years ago. So they were around the show, they were familiar with it, and they're back performing now. This play is really popular. All these kids have seen the movie. People know the music. It, it should be one that really fills seats here at Laura Seaford. Yeah, it's such a fun musical. Like, you know, especially knowing all the ABBA songs from my generation, younger generations with the movies, like everybody knows the songs and can sing along with them. So, um, you know, it's a, it's a great thing to be doing coming out of COVID and being able to be together in a space and be able to celebrate like this, you know, with such a fun show. Who better to take on a musical that deals heavily with family than a pair of sisters? Ella and Hannah Jamal play the leads in Mamma Mia, and they are excited to take on the challenge of meeting the standards set by past Laura Secord Productions. I did not think I would be here. As a grade 10 student, I was expecting to not be a lead character, because usually Secord musicals are a really big deal, and I, and I was going to be happy where, wherever, wherever I was, but I'm, I'm really, really excited to be here. Hannah, you were chosen as part of the ensemble two years ago. This is a big promotion for you. Yeah, and I mean, um, looking back to when I was in grade 10 and selected for the musical, I was just thrilled to be in it at all because C chord musicals have such high expectations. Um, they're a really big deal in the community, so I was just happy to make the cut at all. But it was, it's such a nice promotion and I absolutely love playing this character, especially alongside Ayla. Skylar Abrams was part of the original cast two years ago. I asked her how she felt now that the curtain was finally going to open. Relieved. If any word can describe it, it's relieved. Um, it's been a really long journey and it was very hard to not be able to do it last time. And so being able to come back and do it with a new cast has just been such a wonderful experience. And it's just so amazing that it's finally going to happen. One of my only hopes coming into the new one was that I would get to be a different role because I said if I was going to do it again, I want to do it better. And I want to be able to show everyone that I have matured not only as a person but as an actor and that I'm able to conquer a more challenging role. Everybody already knows this. This is a musical that everyone will enjoy because of the music that is in the show. So getting to show that to other people and be the person singing those songs is special. One thing I love about the situation we're in is that I'm kind of glad we were stuck with the musical Mamma Mia because it's such a beloved show and it's a great musical to be stuck with. I never get tired of the songs, so it's a pleasure to perform them all the time. It feels like we're ready to go. It, it really is. It's exciting. It's closure. It's full circle. It's the longest I've ever worked on a show. But um, yeah, I think we're all, every little piece of it has come together to this point and we're ready. Reporting for The Source, I'm Mike Paulson.